York City, uh, Mickey, you've won at home. Can you finally break this flaming hoodoo on the road? We hope so. Yeah. <laughs> we hope so. We, 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 uh, we came close against Plymouth. We uh, probably deserved at least a point out of there. But um, like, like we said before, we still haven't won away from home, and that's the. If we want to do something this year, we need to start doing it quickly. We don't want to uh, let the gap get bigger between us and the top three. So uh, hopefully starting Saturday at York, we will um, under a new manager now. So hopefully they um, might catch them quite quick and try and get some three points on the board. That's York under a new manager, not sure as we tell them. Yeah, so. yeah. <laughs> but actually that can go one of either way, can't it? It can do, yeah. They're either maybe may not know the style that the manager wants to play yet, but or the other on the other hand they may uh, they all need to impress to get in the manager's head for the rest of the season. So hopefully uh, it's the first one and we can go and catch them on a break and um, score an early goal. That's what I think that's what we need to do because at the moment we're not scoring away from home. So if we go and get an early one, we'll be able to uh, hopefully kick on from there. Have you been at a club when the managers suddenly disappeared? I have. Last year I had three managers in the space of 11 weeks. Lovely. Where was that? So that was at Killy Harriers. We, uh, my first manager left at... The, during end of December, the, uh, a new manager came in, we went to Sunderland away in the FA Cup under him. I went away for a week with England C and I come back and he's gone already. So it was a bit of a turmoil season last year for me but we managed to get over it and the old assistant manager ended up taking over and we uh, nearly got in the playoffs so it would have been a big achievement for us over the season that we had. And they just proved that the squad we had then was good enough to get into the playoffs. I think if the manager didn't leave at the start, who knows what would have happened.